Hello everyone, in this video we are going to learn how to add and subtract integers easily. So in this video I will be solving question 4 of exercise 6.3 class 6 NCRT math book. Let's start with our first part in question 4. Before we start our operations on integers, let's revise the rules for adding and subtracting integers. So there are two basic rules for integer addition and subtraction. First one is when there are two integers with same sign then we'll get positive sign or we'll add the two numbers. The next one is if the two signs are different then we'll get a negative sign or we'll subtract the two numbers. These are the two basic rules. Just remember when the signs are same we will get a positive sign and when the signs are different we are going to get a negative sign. So let's start with our first question A part. So this is minus 7. We will open the bracket. So this is minus 7, minus 8 and minus and minus. So this is minus and minus. Two signs are same. So we will get a positive sign. So this is plus 25. So in our first step, we remove the brackets and of the numbers. Now here we will move from left to right. So first two integers are minus 7 and minus 8. So two signs are same. So we will add the two numbers. So this is 15. 7 plus 8 is 15. And the sign will be of the bigger number. So this is minus 15. And then the next number is plus 25. Now we have two numbers as minus 15 and plus 25. So the two numbers have opposite signs. When the signs are opposite, we will subtract the numbers. So we will get 25 minus 15 is 10. And the sign will be of the bigger number. Here bigger number is 25. Its sign is positive. So this is plus 10. So our final answer is 10. B part is minus 13 plus 32 minus 8 minus 1. So the first step is to remove the bracket. So this is minus 13. So this is minus 13 plus 32 minus 8 minus 1. We'll move from left to right. So this is 13 and 32 we are taking together. So 13 is minus and 32 is plus opposite signs so the two numbers will be subtracted so 32 minus 13 is 19 and the sign will be of the bigger number so plus 32 so plus 19 then minus 8 and minus 1 so here we will take two numbers as 19 and 8 so 19 minus 8 is 11 and the next number is minus 1 so 11 minus 1 is 10. So 10 is our final answer. We will box the answer and we will do the next one. So C part is minus 7 plus minus 8 plus minus 90. First step we will open the brackets. This is minus 7 plus and minus. So plus and minus different sign. So we will get a negative sign. Negative 8 plus and minus Again, we will get a negative sign, so minus 90. Now, we will move from left to right. So, this is minus 7 and minus 8. So, minus and minus will add the two numbers. So, 7 plus 8 is 15. And then the next number is minus 90. Two negative numbers. So, the answer will have a negative sign. Minus 15 and minus 90. So, we will add the two numbers. So this is going to be 105. So our final answer is negative 105. Let's do the last part which is 50 minus minus 40 minus minus 2. So first we will open the bracket. So 50 this is minus and this is minus. So this will become plus 40. Again, minus and minus will become plus 2. So now all numbers are positive. We can directly add all the three numbers. So this is 50 plus 40 is 90. 90 plus 2 is 92. So our final answer is 92. So this completes 
question 4 of exercise 6.3. I hope this video is helpful. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.